when does watching porn become an addiction to porn? There are a lot of people who say, you know, I just watch a little here and there. Um, when, when, when does, when does when do you consider okay watching porn is an addiction to porn and I, let me let me piggyback to this is porn ever just a healthy thing that people do hmm. yeah um to answer the second question um first no um you know the because it is it's a drug you know the way that your body responds to it the way that your brain responds and reacts to it is the same way that it responds to to drugs. So, is there a healthy uh, way to to recreational use drugs? No, people are going to do it because I mean, just people do dumb things all the time. Um, so, no, I don't believe that there is a is a healthy way um, outside of you know all the reasons we're not supposed to um, because it's sin and you know. In, 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 in that whole perspective, but no, from a from a health standpoint, as a certified health and fitness coach for the last ten plus years, there's no healthy use of it. Um, you know, the addiction the addiction question is a challenging one because even even in the clinical world, like there's still mm -hmm. no true acceptance of porn addiction. You look in the DSM five where every other addiction is outlined and it's defined there pornography is not in there you know you still have you know half of the clinical world you have people that go to therapy and their therapist prescribes to them oh you're having difficulty having sex with your wife why don't you guys watch porn together so there's definitely a battle kind of in the space about sure. what yeah. is real you know porn addiction um so i try to you know preface everything i talk about when we discuss porn addiction with that hey like you know clinically maybe it's not fully accepted but how does somebody know or, or how would you know when you're addicted well, if you say you're just casually watching it, then stop. Stop for 30 days, stop for 60 days, stop for 90 days. And I can almost with certainty tell you that 99% of the men that are watching it can't. And the fact that you can't stop doing something, in my opinion, is a clear definition that you have an addiction with it. Um, so it's, it's, it's not the most uh, clinically defined answer. Um, but I think it's, I think at the root of it, I think it really tells you that it's a problem. If you say you only casually watch it, then I challenge you, if it's just a casual thing and it's not really doing anything for you, then just stop. And the fact that you can't stop, I think shows that you, you have an addiction with it. And that's been so, my, my, you know, experience working with, you know, at this point, we've had over a thousand men come through our program in the last 12 months. Right. So let me ask you this: uh, so When when you go to a therapist, let's say a relationship, a couples ther therapist, and they say uh, to watch porn together, is that healthy or unhealthy, from your opinion, Frank? Oh, it's one hundred percent unhealthy because uh, if you're trying to solve a sex problem in your relationship, you said it, uh, you know, a couple of questions back. Porn and sex are not the same thing. So let me turn on this streaming act um and through brain scans we know that when you watch pornography the part of your brain that fires the part of your brain that is stimulated is not the same center of your brain that responds to the physical act of intimacy so you have a portion of your brain that is that is designed to respond to objects so when you see a physical object there's a certain part of your brain that lights up like i have a cup in my hand when i see this cup when i go to pick it up there's a part of my brain that says object cup pick it up now if i was going to have sex if i was going to be in an intimate relationship with with somebody that's the relationship part of our brain it's a completely different center mm -hmm. of our brain that's what's firing in the act of sex so the therapist telling the couple hey go watch sex she's training the man that when he sees a fit when he sees the physical form of a woman in a sexual act that it's an object this is why men that struggle with porn addiction have a problem with objectifying women they've literally trained and conditioned and wired their brain that woman equals object let me use her for my yeah. own pleasure my own short-term gratification yeah. so i think it's the absolute worst right. advice you should give to people that are struggling in a relationship go watch sex i think if you're anybody listening if you're ever told that ask for your money back or leave the session immediately and go find a different therapist